Well, the Jones County Sheriff's race is officially set with four candidates. Emily Blackmar is on your side tonight with the latest on how they want to serve the people of Jones County. In November, Jones County will have four choices for one big decision. The current sheriff, two law enforcement officers, or a past sheriff. Macon Davis won the primary race last night, slating his name on the ballot for November. If elected, he wants the department to be transparent with the community. I want the people to come. I want them to know that the door is open. I want them to know that it will be discreet what they tell us and, and deal with us because look, any law enforcement agency without the public's trust, number one, and number two, without their comments and communication, many times they will know things that we, we don't know and that folks would not tell us. Alex Hodge has previously served 12 years as the sheriff in Jones County. This time he wants to serve differently if elected, starting with changing the culture. Through the door we will bring that positive professional leadership to the table. Uh, to the people of Jones County and to the men and women who are desperate to have it. They're, they're thirsty for strong leadership. They're looking for that leadership and I will provide that leadership for them. Uh, we will immediately begin connecting with people and serving people. We'll immediately begin uh, directed patrols where our visibility, once again, being the greatest deterrent to crime, is very visible across our county. Jones County's current sheriff, Joe Berlin, says he wants to build on the past four years on fighting the drug crisis in the community. Again, we're focusing on the drugs in our community. This is an ever-growing problem, and we're, we're fighting it every day. We've served 200-something cases to 250-something cases a, a year on these uh, drugs and uh, illegal activities in the county. We've had to increase our investigation division because some of the property crime. Reporting in Jones County, Emily Blackmore, WDAM7, on your side. We did reach out to Kenny Rogers Sr., the fourth candidate in the sheriff's race, several times, but we were unable to get an interview with him.